Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna do another episode of Behind the Punish. We have Divine Tricks over here. A shall you, man? Tell us, tell a bit about yourself, please. Hey, I'm a Scottish shall you player, uh, the player for Axie Bay. Uh, th that's all you need to know. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy the games. <laughs> uh, so anyway, we're gonna. You know the format already. If you don't, roll the clip over here. Now I'm going to ask the guest a multiple of questions, but here's the catch. This is going to be all done while fighting each other to make the overall experience a bit more exciting. Okay, first question. Uh, Divine yep. Tricks. Oh, no, yes. No, 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 no. Um, so, you're, you're pretty well known as being a Shao Yu main. Yes. Yeah? Um, do you think when, when uh, playing and... Uh, uh, fuck. When you're playing and, um... <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> when you're playing and, uh, seeing how, uh, people other react to show you, how yeah. do you, uh, feel with the stereotype of show you being, like, a mashy character? Like, what do you say to those people? Uh... Just, uh, I'm playing the matchup wrong. <laughs> the people who say, yeah, oh yeah, why is this guy mashing with Shao Yu? Mate, you just need to know your options. You gotta yeah. learn to play against the character. It doesn't matter if it's bad or that. It's, it's a whole point in tech, and you're gonna have good matchups and you're gonna have bad matchups. Yeah, and like, a... it's, it's the same thing with kind of Eddie as well. Like, most people yeah. say, yo, bro, come on. You're just playing You're just playing a mashing character? Just learn the match. Yeah. Just, just be good, bro. <laughs> just get good. Easy. No, I thought you were going oh, to do the rage God. drive. I thought. Yeah, <laughs> no. uh, so you're a Scottish player, I see. And uh, yeah, yeah. how was the like first thing when you got, went out and went to a Scottish local? How did they treat you, like uh, with respect or or not with respect? Since you're playing, show you. Uh, well, I can tell they were being nice, but bait, I can tell they were probably just like, yo, fuck this guy, man. Fuck this guy in the scrubby lane. Nah, but they were extremely, they were extremely welcoming. And they're the ones which uh, advised me to keep coming and just help me improve overall. So it was good to see. And uh, I would not be this good uh, without them. Without them, yeah. So so who would be your your training partner if there is any? Like, is there someone you would say, like, really helped you? Like, a significant someone that really helped you out to be at this level? Or would you say... Well, would you say I'd you did say, it yourself? I'd say a, a lot of people within the... Uh, so you can't name one? You can't name one? I, I, could, I, could, I could name, you know, like the whole Scottish scene. They, they all helped me. But I'd say, kind of over the lockdown period, uh, Bolt Raka. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's, that's this guy is good, man. If you haven't seen Bolt, he's like one of the best Noctuses in Europe, <laughs> and he, his, and he, he never plays like a normal Noctus main. He he plays so f much fundamental. You think he's playing someone like a Mishima? That's how fundamental he is. He makes the character look S tier. Yeah. I'm just like, bro, this this character so broke. D but did, he's did he travel from, from uh from away from Scotland or? Uh, he he's still in Scotland just now, but he's originally from the Netherlands. Ah, oh, I see, I see. So but he's been living in Scotland for at least quite a while now. So thanks to COVID, <laughs> you're gonna oh man, <laughs> you're gonna say uh, he he improved your Tekken skill, right? He he helped me during the lockdown our uh, period since uh, me him and a few others played a lot. But he 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 sat me down. He went over a lot of stuff with me, and wow. made me think a lot more. And just kind of help understand a, a, with, like, a different perspective to the game, right? Because yeah, exactly. That that's what happens when you're when you thank you for the high crush. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> when you when you meet new people, th that's the way that uh, you improve as a an actual character because it's the thing is oh my god the thing is like as as soon as I w traveled a bit abroad, I seen much more people uh, like giving you more opinions on how you should play yeah because it's it's truly very good to have multiple opinions on how you should play and no 
No fam, the, the setups. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, so I've mentioned COVID. How yeah. was the online treating you? Like online tournaments? Uh, I played in like a few, so it wasn't uh, too bad. For me, I found it was kind of like good XP, just the fact that I'm able to play players that that I normally wouldn't be able to. Uh, Would have other ways. Or, or, yeah, with like traveling, like traveling, like it's good because I get to meet all kind of the different players. The thing with online is, especially during kind of like COVID, it allows me to play with players that I normally wouldn't with. So that was uh, extremely like fun and helpful, at least to see anyway. Um, uh, and how is your mentality going into an online tournament? Like, if you lose, what's what's the reaction? Because I still take it very bad. I hate losing. But even yeah. if, when it's online, I hate even more losing because there's some things that you can't even control, like flag and tech yeah. in, tech in. Like, have has there been any moments where you say, I, I'll never enter a Tekken tournament again and next week you do again? <laughs> bit, like, don't, don't get me wrong, like, Tekken's a game where it's like, you can get annoyed. Um, especially, well, like, especially with, like, what you said, like, lag, uh, can definitely affect it and come into play but the thing is you just got to think of it as experience and i would rather it happen now than it happen offline you know offline when it matters yeah yeah offline when it when it truly matters when you have a crowd when you have people watching you it's it's something that you one must one must learn to accept that yeah he, he might he might do fuck up so here and there and it it's thanks to these online tournaments that you get somewhat the same pressure being yeah. in, in, in an offline tournament. That's why I, yeah, I really recommend people, if you haven't ever been in an online tournament, try try one in like the next week. There's, all, there's always... One's happening. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. And being the way it is, why do you still pick Shao Yu over like for for example Fokum Ram like for being a, a true uh, because people who want to win generally pick top tiers. So that's yeah. what, that for example for me I have a I have a Poké pick Leroy because Eddie has the those do, do, fuck I didn't punish. Oh. <laughs> Le, uh, Eddie has the uh, pretty much matchups which are totally no one has oh, favor yeah yeah man and do you think you should change character when the time comes or or you're gonna stick with which uh, i'll probably stick with shall you just the fact that i've played all so much and i'm not gonna put an effort to learn or not just to like pick, pick like fakaman for example that for all you know may not be in the next second so who knows so you you prefer doing uh, sticking to your guns rather yeah. than picking a high level character? I see. No, no, not like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, sorry guys, this is intense. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. No, fam. No, fam. <laughs> Speaking of tournaments, I've seen I I've, I've seen your Smash history and. The most tournament yeah. that it has, like, has has really uh, stood out was the Berlin Clash tournament back in last year. Yeah. Uh, uh, you you came in 17th. You top 32, if I'm not mistaken. Um, you yeah. you lost to uh, Cherry Berry Mango. How was how was that comparing to other people from the EU? How did he play differently? Ah. Uh. He, he, don't get me wrong, like, CBM is like, very good, and he plays with Sodam and Weka, probably two of the best Shao Yu players in the world. And even I'm sitting here like, yo, what am I going to do versus this guy? This guy play, plays against two of the best players that I look up to, and I'm sitting here like, uh, I guess I'll try and do what I can. But no, it was a really fun experience to see how he deals with Shao Yu. Mm, so, so you see another top tier player seeing how his how his uh, reaction is to your moves. 
is something that like you can't take for granted to be yeah. honest. The same thing Im happened with which John Ding when I played him. It's like this guy just reacts so different. That's the thing, it's just complete different playstyle that you wouldn't be used to. But I was just uh I found it cool with what tools that he kinda like, opted for. He he was using uh don't get me wrong, like forward four is like a really good move by him. But if Link does like four four three for like a keep out, uh it's like where she just runs up and kicks you and if you hold down back, it can create like a lot of space. So that is like a mind game uh between it. Um but he knew his ranges and forward forward just it clipped me even though I was holding down back and it was more like a range thing and that was his knowledge from playing like so damn Weka knowing when he can uh, use forward four. So so like it, it, it shook you that he knew what to do in those moments. Yeah. Cause uh, at the time I would just like, yo, what is this? <laughs> I was like, this might be safe. Um <laughs> But then I looked back at it and I tested a few things. I was like, so that's his reason for doing it. And I was like, damn, this is. In retrospect, what would you eventually have done better if, like, the divine tricks from now? What what he have what what, what would he have done if he uh, faced him again? I'd say just be more more confident. More confident in your abilities. Yeah, more confident and just to play my game. I don't think I played that bad done. against him. Okay. I think I played fairly well, but it was a few mistakes which kind of caused my mentality to kind of go down a wee bit. Like, uh, I dropped the the first game. It was 3-1. But before he won that last game, uh, I thought I reached the wall. And then I called for a rage arc. And I unfortunately didn't get the wall due to the camera angle. I thought I did, but I wasn't able to uh, see the wall. So you got too uh, hesitant. Uh, uh, I, if, if, I'm, if I'm actually uh, hearing that right, you got too hesitant yeah. and you just said, yo bro, I'm gonna do a rage out. <laughs> Pray to God it hits. <laughs> it was during a, during a combo. I thought I got the right wall carry, but it just fell too short. And then... Uh, Cause I thought I would have gone on like a low wall splat. Really? Yeah, and then it was just kind of unfortunate, but well, that's the game. It's the that game. Was, yeah. That was, yeah. It, 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 it's, part, it's part of the game, and that was like my bad. Anyway. But what is this? I'm trying to fucking <laughs> <laughs> mix you up, you know? No, <laughs> I'm sitting here like, bro, I don't want to do shit. <laughs> because I was trying to grab you? No, fam, no, fam. I, I love this and still got here. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the pickup. Come on. Fuck! No. no. <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm standing here. Yo, what is this? <laughs> uh, so, we've talked about being. being, uh, like. highly regarded as one of them. The most. like, when you speak about Chao Yu, Divine Tricks is mentioned here or there you know how does yeah. it how does it play into you being uh like oh no no oh thank no you. what <laughs> thank you how does it play in in the process of be trying to get better like is it because they mention you or is it because you really want to improve in the game hey uh, I, I just want to improve it's like when, when it's like you play a character uh, like I never in a million years I'll be the best player in the world, cause there's like so many like gods like Ni, Lohai, Chanel, Arslan, with all of them about. But to me, I would be at least like one of the best Shaoyu players. Uh, in Europe. In the world. Uh, uh, and and the world. And the world, yeah. So so you at least want to have that respect that within that character you're one of the best named, best named in the world. What I want to hear is uh, if someone just like I'm looking to pick up Ling. Who do you think I should watch in terms of like, gameplay wise? And he mentions you, and you'd be happy yeah. about that. Yeah, that would be, that would be very cool to be honest. Having people watch you to learn the character, yeah. it's quite it's quite nice. Come, nope. Oh Yo. no! Almost left again. <laughs> 
Nope. Uh, so... When did you really recognize that, yo, this is the time where I actually focused in the game? And, uh, like, you say, yeah, I'm pretty decent than the average folk. <clears throat> like, when did you notice that uh, when you played the game? Uh, I was kind of like, I looked in to show you a bit more drinking in like season one, then don't get me wrong, I was still a like, hell of a scrub. But I learned a lot more just from watching and also getting advice from kind of like, Scottish players. They're like, you need to be like more uh, solid, otherwise, you're just going to keep uh, like giving away rounds yeah. for free and just dying to a lot of stuff. Um, so, with that, I think it was about like season 2, season 3, I I'd say season 3 was when I went, I want to uh, become much better. So, so, so you said, yeah, it's it's time for me to uh, be the best that I could be. Yeah. And uh, it's this roughly the same period where I did the same thing. How did not? Holy oh. shit, oh my you god! <laughs> Your ID is so good. <laughs> Top tier, bro. Please nerf him. You. Come on. What the f- Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> bro, ID is too good, man. You see that? Yeah. The yeah. keeper. The keeper, bro. You can't just- can't. Come on. He just <laughs> puts on dominance into the, into the game and say, yo, bro. Come at me whenever you want. <laughs> if a man started doing that, bro, I'd, j I'd just quit the game, man. <laughs> I'd be mad, just take the win. <laughs> if you're in an offline tournament, just shake his hand. Yeah, I'm out, guys. <laughs> uh, yo, this guy wants to, 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 to this guy. <laughs> so, as, as I said, you've been you've been mentioned as being one of the best EU Shao Yu mains. Being that, have you ever been uh, recognized in a tournament? Yeah, outside, no, not outside of Europe, but like in in a tournament in general. Uh, yeah, I have been, and to be honest with you, is whether it be personal like UK, like when I went to Berlin, mm -hmm. uh, b before I actually played uh against uh someone, I'm I'm not gonna mention their names. No problem. I bro. I I got called before I played them. Uh, I sh shall you. So to an extent, I got recognized, but I would just say, "Yo, I'm playing a shit show you play next." I'm like, "Yo, why you gonna do me like that?" Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> why would you have to slant? Oh, fuck them, bro. That punish, you see? No. <laughs> well, like you know, but you s at least you got to the point where people still say, "Yo, bro, he's he must be a threat." If someone said. Like, if someone actually insults you, then they must be fear you in a way. That's how I that's how I see it, at least. Because if, yeah, yeah. if, if they haven't, if they didn't know even what, what who you are, they wouldn't even recognize that you would be, in fact, a shitty show you. <laughs> <laughs> As it, you all take it. Um, but it was funny after him seen uh seen that, I would just say. Like, let me quickly beat you. I was just like, it's fine, you, you don't need to pay anything. I'll, I'll, I'll do it free of charge. There's that. I'll be okay. So then I was just lucky enough. In fact, in fact, no, I wasn't even lucky enough. I gave the guy the smoke. <laughs> I gave the guy the smoke and... But I did not see the guy at all. <laughs> not, not, not even the second day. The man just went... Wait, I'm, I'm, I'm going back home, man. Uh, I'm done. I, I, need I'm done. My <laughs> I, need, I need to get my flight back. You know, I'm not happy. I would just say... That, guys, that happened to me, to be honest, as well. That happened to me. That, this guy didn't expect that I would be that good. Because, as a Maltese man, mm. people wouldn't think... Pe Maltese yeah. people are good, you know? And uh, they came to Malta to participate in, in the Maltese National Cup. And mm. he's a he's a Lee main. And basically... I won him 2-0, straight out of the bat. It's it's still a round robin, mm. but since he didn't expect to to uh, actually lose against me, he quit the tournament. <laughs> well, why end on the first place? 
Yeah, I know, I know, I know, and th that's the thing, that's the thing. Why would you enter in the first place to, if, to, uh, to lose to me, and because he lost to me, he won't play anymore? That's, that's such a dumb That's mentality. a pure excuse. Yeah, man. That's, that's yeah, a pure excuse and a bad mentality I have. But you know what, the, the way that you need to think about it, you I made this man do that, and I didn't even try. <laughs> <laughs> And if yeah, did you boy. press? Please tell me you did. No, bro! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! I've tried oh, it three man. times so far. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man! Uh, so, so I think almost all of the questions are answered except the most important one. Okay, the most important one. Okay. What's okay. the most? <laughs> What's the most? You felt guilty crushing a mid, okay? Which, which, <laughs> when did you feel the most guilty when you crushed a mid? Uh, probably when, okay, wait. Hear me out, hear me out. Hear me out, come on. <laughs> so, uh, Waldo, the, he's a Kizumi man from Scotland. Yeah, yeah. And I was playing uh, him in tournament. Now it's just like, yo, this guy keeps, he keeps using down for the one, and it's, it's, it's annoying. <laughs> I can't do anything. His, his and keep out. <laughs> I had, I had the mentality, my mentality then, where I was, I was getting like done for one to hell. I was like, you know what, fuck it. And I was just <laughs> like, I know this. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I know this is extremely bad for me to do, and I don't carry it. And of course, uh, Kizumi can just uh, forward off forward, one, yeah. off forward uh, for Makaro since it's like a knee and most of you put party. But somehow I managed to crush it down forward one and he just looked at me and I was just like, I'm, <laughs> yo, yo, I'm sick! <laughs> Sucks to be you, bro. <laughs> but he's just like, why did that uh, crush? I'm just like, just nah, I knew, I, knew, I knew it was the thing, I loved it, I loved it. <laughs> Just allow it, bro. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> just, just give me, <laughs> just give me the punishment, please. <laughs> oh no, but it was, it was so funny. He just looked at me after. He was just like, "Yo, what happened?" I was like, "Bro, I love this. Trust me. I did not love it at all. I did not love it at all. I just went, fuck it. It was uh, oh my days, no. Let's go." <laughs> I don't Bl blame it on forward. the leg, blame it on the leg, come on. <laughs> I done what was it? One down two in the Kairo. Mm. But I got the one down two on her, then I would just say, you know what, fuck it, I'm taking my mics up. No. Like oh no, that was you what? Eddie's a different beast bro. Eddie's a different beast, he's built. Built different Yeah man. <laughs> <laughs> Yo what does man back dash and out everything? Come on. Thank you. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, man. Hey. So, thank you for doing the interview. I hope you really enjoyed the questions. Um, ah, uh, so good. Uh, would you, what would they, would the viewers find you? Where would they find you, if anyway? Uh, you can find me on Twitch, you can find me on YouTube, and you can find me on Twitter. Uh, my Twitter's. A uh, divine tracks underscore TK, same for my Twitch, <laughs> and my YouTube is just divine tracks. Divine so if you're looking yeah. to learn anything, right. shall you related all that? This uh, man's the boss, bro. <laughs> this one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you're looking for anything, man, I'll be happy to help. Okay. Um. So that concludes the episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment on who should we get next let's get mr croft so we can crush these guys <laughs> anyways thank you guys see you see you next episode bye guys